Welcome to the series of How To. Hello guys. So welcome to another video of uh, how to draw with PowerPoint. And uh, in today's uh, video, right? Like I'm going to uh, show you how we can draw this uh, clip art items. So I guess like uh, you might have been uh, very much familiar with uh, the term clip art. So this is mostly used to uh, uh, showcase uh, real world, I real world characters uh, in the form of icons. Okay, so this is mostly used in uh, PowerPoint presentations and stuff. So, so mostly these kind of images uh, are there in Google image and uh, most of them are copyrighted and you might have to pay to uh, use that as well. So today I am going to teach you like uh, uh, how you can do, you can arrive at the same uh, stuff using uh, uh, PowerPoint itself. Okay. So, so let's get started. Uh, so this is the first uh, thing I'm going to do. I guess this is the easiest. Okay, so this just comes up with two shapes. Okay, so the one circle is what I'm going to pick, and then the second one is uh, this rounded uh, rectangle. Okay, so let me align it uh, with this circle, and I'll just extend it to the right. And with this yellow icon, I'm just going to drag it to the left to make it look like a rounded corner. Okay. And slightly make it big. And I'm going to color both of them black. And remove outline. So this is the easiest thing to achieve. Okay. Of course, you can make it slightly fatter or even thinner. So it's up to your discretion. Um, so the next one. So this is something similar to like what we did in the previous one. So I'm going to copy the same thing what I did. I'm going to paste it here. Okay. And of course this guy is slightly short. And yeah. I'm just going to pull this guy up. Okay. Now I need to bring this uh, empty neck portion right so I'm going to choose the same circle copy paste and I'll make it slightly large and I'm going to paint it white okay and I'm going to send him back and I'm going to send this body section back to back as well okay so what I have done here is uh, so this is like a bigger uh, white circle right so if i draw an outline you will be able to see it very well okay so this is the bigger white circle okay and uh, uh, and this white is kind of uh, hiding this uh, this black portion okay so the moment i remove uh, the outline you give, it gives a different uh, a picture okay but again there could be questions saying like this is anyway wide this is not transparent so how can we make this one transparent right so that's quite easy just to copy everything and uh, paste it some uh, paste it with image as like a picture okay so this is not a shape this is just a picture and uh, to make it more clear right let me give some background here so send it to back okay uh, so this is a picture and I am going to remove this white section. So I am going to pick the same uh, shape fill color and uh, no, actually I am going to go to the format. So format tab in that you have uh, something called colors and uh, there is something called set transparent color. Here I am going to pick this white. Okay. So now this uh, 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 this this white section is gone of course there is a small ring and uh, you can uh, do it again once or twice to make it uh, make even this ring disappear okay so so now you are actually getting a transparent uh, background as such okay so this is with the second image and uh, for the third one i am going to Better I will draw it uh, uh, again, right? So I can even paste it here and uh, edit it slightly. Okay, uh, let me take this head portion 
to the right and I just made this guy slightly taller and wider as such and I am going to make this oval and I just got it here maybe the head is slightly small okay now I got it. so I got uh, the head almost uh, the same shape as this one okay and I am just going to need a tie here so that's going to be simple I'll just make it small look like a small circle just keep it here and I will take a trapezium okay and make it overlap pull it here and drag this yellow slightly inwards to make it look more like a tie and I'm going to select these two and fill it with uh, dark gray without any outline so maybe we can make this guy slightly fat okay so this guy is wearing a tie now so the last one this is going to be slightly tricky uh, but still I'm going to use the same previous icon here the image is tricky because this guy has a stylish hairstyle okay so remaining is all same maybe I can even uh, give him uh, the same blue tie okay uh, so I am going to draw this guy uh, uh, to have like a stylish hairstyle okay so what I am going to do is like pick this oval fill it with a slight gray color okay and this time I might need an outline so shape outline I am going to pick it as black and it is too thin so I am going to go to the weight section and make it three points okay I think this is a bit more dark I'll pick this one okay now so the next thing we might have to do is like uh, get him uh, this uh, hair right so I'm going to choose this uh, semicircle again I will make it slightly small okay I am going to zoom in to see that this circle fits in with this head okay is he yeah I think uh, I think this fits well okay so I'm going to paint black again and uh, outline will also be black and uh, so this has uh, this kind of uh, curved groomed hair right so and uh, these two shapes as such so I'm going to take this oval okay place it here and fill it with black now I need to bring in this uh, things as such so I'm going to pick this moon shape okay so fill it with black fill the outline with black make it small I just made it slightly smaller copy that again paste it I'll make it further smaller and paste it here I'm just going to zoom in so that I get this rotating stuff uh, to make it look slightly random okay and uh, this edge is a curved one and this one is like a flat cornered one uh, I think I just lost the focus okay yeah so this one has to be curved so I'm just going to copy the same thing paste it and drag this guy and this moon is almost like a semicircle now okay so I'll make it further smaller I'll put it here 
and then make it look like a curve okay this guy is actually missing a collar and uh, I'm going to take a parallelogram and it is here fine okay I'll make it still a bit more smaller and I am going to paint it with dark grey and no outline and copy this paste it again and I am going to go to this format tab rotate flip horizontal I just got him the second color as such okay so that's all guys for uh, today's session so if you like this video please uh, uh, subscribe to the channel and uh, hit bell icon so that you don't miss out any future uh, such videos thank you